if you don't like bitterness if you don't like tit for tat if you don't like going back and forth if you don't like getting that lick back please do not watch this video hey couture bays it's your girl brit pratt going live with the breeze talk and bay squad we have got to talk the podcasters are acting up they're shaking the table dj academics is dragging scissor Tory Lanez is selling merch and Ricky and Dizel are talking about the queen of hip hop and of course Cardi B. But before we get started, let's like, comment, and subscribe. Tap that notification bell so you can get all the updates and alerts. And remember, opinions are not facts. Everything we say here is allegedly and for entertainment purposes solely. So sit back, relax, sip you some apple juice or my favorite vegan water and let's get into the mess, shall we? Cardi B, a lot of these labels mm -hmm. not take anybody else to get them. Nope, no, 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 no. Because mm -hmm. a lot of a lot of people when Nicki was around, they was trying to, damn, bitch, you're not Nicki. I can't do it. Da, da, da. But when Cardi B did it with a different okay. type of thing, they was like, maybe someone with followers can transfer into the mainstream media. And she showed that bitch you can do well, it. Well, why do you think that um, but why do you think no one ever gives her, her flowers? I feel like all the rap girls really never give Cardi all her flowers. I feel flowers. like all the rap girls they always give Nicki her flowers. Oh, no, no, the, the rap girls give Nicki her flowers, but things some most of the rap girls give Nicki her flowers because they want to feature. Oh. That's what the real <laughs> That's is. so sad. Because they want a feature, bitch. And when they get that feature, and then they go off and run and do something else. Yeah. Cardi, a lot of the girls give her her flowers behind closed doors, and that's the problem. Woo, Bay Squad, how do y'all feel about this? What are your thoughts on that? You know, do you feel it's a compliment or do you feel it's shady? And that's why so many people have an issue with Meg the Stallion. Question mark, question mark. You can hear the rest of that on We Said What We Said podcast. But baby, at the end of the day, if you're not in it, don't insert yourself. That's how I feel about it. But speaking of beef, look at Tory Lane selling his merch. I honestly don't know how to feel about it it because he has fans and if his fans want to support then so be it there's a lot of people who have tracks produced by Tory Lanez um features with him so they're gonna double tap and they don't want to see him in prison at the end of the day I don't feel that way I feel like if I like his music I like it and if I don't I don't but I ain't writing no letters to no judge but let's get into this SZA versus DJ Academics because y'all what happened every time y'all clown this bitch this bitch be on her under a knife like that's a fact that's why I heard that's that's the thing about SZA. SZA insecure, bitch had freckles, take it off, all that weird shit. Every time y'all clown her, she about to like, you know what I mean, like do a million things. Bitch, you try to play with me one time. I'm on your ass today. Fuck that. I don't give two fucks about you industry niggas. I don't give a fuck about your tour nor your fucking album. Stop fucking playing with me. We on our fucking ass, man. We still fucked over. We just got to keep it a bean with you. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie now. We might have to pay her back your ass because, like, goddamn, what the fuck is this? What the fuck is this, man? What the fuck? Yo, you know the crazy thing is? Let me keep it a beam. SZA is as fat as me. That's 100% facts. This is why when bitches call me fat, fat, I'll be laughing. You whores are fat just like me. Y'all go to the doctor. You suck it out. Yo, bitch, you got a double chin on Paru. I ain't Paru. I just don't like to say it. You suck the fat out of there and put it into your ass. Your ass be looking lopsided. Your belly button be looking weird. Because they don't move that bitch around. It's like tic-tac-toe. Factuals, my nigga. SZA is fat as me. Body built like a smart fucking car. She holding this fucking clutch. Bitch, we know you a fat bitch. Like, come on, man. So, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't know what she did to me, but, like, I've been had it on for her. Like, fuck that. I'm on time, and I'm sorry to say. Yes, I'm on some liquor. Oh, my God. What did SZA do to this man? Ain't no way Alvin is over there acting like that. But I will say this. SZA is a catfish. I mean, that that picture that went viral, baby, you can't find it nowhere. She has a really good team that will scrub the internet to delete horrible pictures of her and then she will put up them photoshop ones so when he says she don't look like her pictures he's not lying but those are just my thoughts those are my opinions if you want me to go live let me know how do you feel comment down below i gotta go bye hoes